Hey, you know, honestly, it might not look like it in this shot, but boy, I am excited. Today, we're recording a day in my life as a remote college student. Like any Gen Zer, I tend to set a lot of great resolutions about limiting my technology use. And, you know, I fulfill about zero of them. Not to brag. Here, you know, exhibit A, you got me looking at my phone, even though I told myself I'd stop looking at my phone when I immediately wake up. That doesn't happen. And I can start with my day. The first thing I like to do is, you know, get some food in my system. Or so I tell this video. Realistically, I maybe eat breakfast and drink coffee twice a week. Um, but, you know, for the sake of the aesthetics, we're gonna eat breakfast today. When I do eat breakfast, I tend to try to actually stay away from my phone. Um, I think that in a lot of parts of our lives, we'll have plenty of time to be on our devices. Um, and I feel like especially because of the way that quarantine has set us up, eating is really the only time that I actually do have to not really be on my phone. After breakfast, I immediately jump to the room where I must confront my reality, which is a day of just staring at a two foot by one and a half foot screen while the world speeds by around me. On the days where I'm actually fortunate enough to wake up and actually get working at 10 a.m., it's probably because I have some collection of meetings that I need to attend to. This morning, it was specifically doing product management work with my friend Albert, as well as a meeting with a nonprofit that I'm working with right now. Squeezed in between all this is a urgent need to finish a video I've pushed off since early August, and so hence the coffee. Oh, how the time flies. It is already 12 o'clock or 1 o'clock or some o'clock. Yeah, it's 1 o'clock and I gotta eat, you know? So I ate. And once again, we stick to the no phone policy. So no phones, except sometimes. I don't know, I make exception for lunch. I tend to watch Netflix during this time, but I didn't do it today, so I'm proud of myself. Around this time, some of the more attentive folks may be noticing that I actually don't go to class. Well, jokes on you, I actually do. It's just at 1.30 and it only happens like twice a week. I get some work done right afterwards and I jump on another series of Zoom calls. It's pretty repetitive. And yeah, I still have a good time. Or so I think. At 5.30, I jump on a devotional time with my college fellowship, Make New. We go over a chapter of the Bible for every week and discuss it. It's actually really helpful in terms of helping me better understand my faith. After DT, I try to do something more pertaining towards a long-term goal, such as a job. So in this case, it was leak code, but I didn't really have the motivation to do it. So I think what I ended up doing was uh, just lying in bed, which I did not record. I try to cook dinner with my mom as frequently as possible. Unfortunately, this doesn't happen every day, but I think that given that I'm home, it's like the least that I can do. I didn't record us eating dinner though because my parents have a strict no recording us policy. So I kind of violated that already a couple times today. If there is one task that I am designated to do every day, it's washing the dishes. It's okay. I don't know what I'm supposed to say about this. I just wash the dishes. Okay. On to the next shot. <laughs> I return back to my work after dinner and am pretty much at this desk until I go to bed. So there's not really that much fun stuff to show you. So here's some ASMR of the keyword my friends gave me for my birthday. You know, at some point I call it quits and I decide I'm too tired to keep on working. This luckily coincides with normally when my girlfriend decides to call me. So we chat a little bit if she's busy, you know, I'll do some work while she's working or vice versa. And then we just call it a night.
I answer my last few emails and messages and then I try to read. Kind of like my wake up routine, I really don't do a good job committing to this pattern. I'm normally on my phone, I end up listening to comedy or watching some Netflix. There are days where I feel more motivated, but today was not one of those days. 